friends, how are you doing? This is Zed from Zed Outdoors and I hope you're having an awesome day. So, the first phase of the roof is done. It was quite simple what I did. Trimmed up the sides with the axe, taking off any sharp bits, laid it on top of the actual uh, structure itself, drilled the holes, pegged in some wooden dowels, and then trimmed those dowels off to make it flush. And that is it, that's about as sophisticated as it gets. So, the reason why this is the first phase is the second phase is obviously the actual waterproofing. There's obviously a lot of gaps in there and that's kind of more of a foundation. And so what I want to be doing is moving forward. It's probably going to be one of the last things I do because I am still yet to decide how I'm going to waterproof it. So I have refined it to about two or three ideas uh, that I'm going to do in the future. So temporarily what I'm going to do is just put a plastic tarp over the top just to keep it waterproof and that is literally just temporary. And as soon as I've uh, sourced the materials to make it more permanent, then obviously that waterproofing layer is going to come off and then it's going to be a 100% natural roof. And in that way, the whole structure itself, the core structure is 100% natural. So there you go. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Pretty straightforward. It's actually taken me, me an entire day to get this done. Although it doesn't look like it on video. So obviously I want to keep it quite, quite short uh, uh, where possible. So... If you haven't done so already, you can check out the Bushcraft uh, Basecamp series by clicking the link below. That will take you to the playlist. I appreciate you watching, and I'll see you on the next phase of the build. We're cracking forward now, and we're making some good progress. So, until the next time, I hope whatever you're doing, you have a blessed day, a blessed week ahead. This is Ed from Zed Outdoors. Peace out.